Do you like barbecue? Do you like brunch? How about a barbecue brunch? Oh, I found a great spot in Bucks County. Come on, let's go. You know, when you're up here in Peddler's Village, you get a little tired of walking through all the shops. How about we get a little messy with some Texas-style barbecue? Turn here. Holy Q barbecue. Where's Tommy? What's up, man? Bringing the barbecue you, to New Hope. You see I love it. Texas barbecue does not hide its meat like Carolinas and everything else. We use no sauce, strictly salt and pepper. Uh, we're pizza plate, meaning everything we make that day sells out. Folks are walking around Peddler's Village. Uh -huh. They want to get a little messy. Is that what it is? It's all about the mess, too? Uh, it could be, yeah, if you eat enough of it. OK, well, yeah. I got my white shirt on today. I don't know if that's going to I got a towel for you. So oh, good. good. We got towels. We got yeah. towels. Let me show you how the smoker works. OK. All right. So this is where we make our meat daily. Uh, okay. Again, we're pits a plate. So this holds between 500 and 1,000 pounds of meat. Uh, per day, it's strictly wood fired. Uh, it's a beast. I mean, we kind of got a lot of food with this. It lets it go vault. Sides, yeah. We do mac and cheese, cornbread, uh, pinto beans, which is a classic. West Texas cream corn, which is a crown favorite. I love cream corn. My mouth is watered. Come on. Let's well, go. today's let's brunch. Eat. So let's start. Let's do it. All right. And of course, we need napkins. Lots of napkins. Lots of napkins. Oh. All right. So what we just started is our barbecue brunch. So what do we have here? What's this first? We have our buttermilk uh, waffles and chicken. Waffles? Chicken and waffles? Waffle. Yes, sir. Look at this. We'll do a Vermont maple syrup. OK. Serve with a lemon scone as well as the old-fashioned ambrosia. Oh, they don't make that anymore. They don't. Mm. The chicken's so juicy, just falling apart. So what do you have here? Pancakes. Uh, do a pulled pork pancake. So picture of bacon mixed in with a pancake. Get out. Hold on. It's heaven. I was wondering what that is. So inside there. Inside. Is mixed in. Do our 12-hour uh, smoked pulled pork. I love the pulled pork for breakfast. Yeah. You know what? It's a different kind of breakfast. Yeah. And it's you simple. Move over, you know, bacon, egg, and cheese. Yes. Yeah. We got this for you. Uh, this is a brisket and egg taco. So we do our 14-hour uh, smoked brisket. Uh, chop it up, just salt and pepper, a little bit of pico de gallo. You know, Tex-Mex is a very heavy influence in the uh, mm -hmm. Texas barbecue. Mm -hmm. Now, every time you purchase one of these, you get a complimentary drink. Uh, you get a Bloody Mary mimosa or a craft cocktail that we're doing. Well, you know what? It's kind of like brunch time. It is. I will have a little Bloody Mary. It's 12 o'clock somewhere. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Homemade? Homemade. <sighs> Good. Because we don't have a liquor license, everyone who picks up a brunch item or any barbecue gets a free complimentary drink. Okay. Um, we do mimosas, Bloody Marys, and I heard you like bourbon, so we're doing a bourbon cocktail for you. All right, let's try All right, it. ready to go? So I brought out the china for you. Uh, we do a little bit of uh, agave, which is the uh, raw blue, a little bit of lime juice. Okay. Top it off with a little ginger beer. Oh, ginger beer. And then one of your favorite bourbon is. Brunch in New Hope. Ah, oh, that's good. Yeehaw! There you go. Here, yep. oh, I love orange cream. Just like an orange cream sickle. Hold on. Yeah, now from the moment it. you walk in, you see all the memorabilia. So I try and keep it real, real old school. That's what's so cool. You know what? Especially when you bring the family, you bring yeah. the kids. They can sit, they can look around, put the phones down, you yeah. know, and kind of take it all in. So how did I actually come up with the name Holy Q? What's Honestly, we yeah. tried Holy Smokes and Holy Cow. Everything was taken, so Holy Q it was. I love it. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Your new home and new hope for barbecue is Holy, Holy Q. Q.